Good morning and Chag Sameach. We are celebrating today Shavuot, giving and receiving the Torah. What a special holiday this will be for us. When we say the blessing for the Torah, we say noten ha-Torah. We thank God who gives us the Torah. We are available and open to receive Torah every single day. It's not an event that happened in the past. It is an ongoing process. And let's see what today's Midah is. Today we have a Midah that I know will resonate with all of us. Kabbalat Yisurin, accepting suffering. Suffering is a part of all of our lives. And there are many ways in which we feel that we are suffering now the pain of isolation and the implosion of our lives as we have come to know and love them is causing us a great deal of suffering. And it's completely okay if we acknowledge the pain and the sense of loss and grief that we are experiencing right now. And yet the Midah is Kabbalat Hayasurin, accepting that suffering. While we don't invite suffering in our lives, we accept and recognize that some suffering comes to each of us. It is part of life and it does us no good to deny that. And yet I am so partial to the Chinese proverb that says, you cannot prevent the birds of sorrow from flying over your head, but you can prevent them from building a nest in your hair. To me, this means that even as we recognize and appreciate that suffering is normal and natural, we don't welcome it, we don't encourage it, we don't massage and pick at it. We recognize it, we accept it, and then we try to the best of our ability to let it go. As we celebrate the holiday of Shavuot and we get ready to enter into Shabbat, Let's think about our relationship to suffering, how we can accept it without embracing it. Shabbat Shalom.